What is up guys, Jeremy here and welcome back to another video. So I'm gonna show you guys a really cool trick on how to make your folder names completely blank. Now I think it's a really cool setup and we will be using the same website that we did for when we made blank app icons. As you guys can see, my top row of icons is invisible and we're using that same website. If you guys wanna see how to make blank icons, I will leave the video link for that down in the description. But as you guys can see, my folders don't have any names. They're just blank below them. And I think it's a really cool looking effect. Also, when you open the folder, there's no name at the top. Again, I think it makes it look more clean and it's just uh, a cool little trick that I think. So as you guys can see, I do have a application or a folder rather here that has a name still. And we're actually gonna make that blank for demonstration in this video. So the first thing you're going to want to do is go into Safari here and we're going to go to tool iPhone. I will leave the link for this down in the description. And as you can see, there is I empty blank folder name. So go ahead and select on that section. It'll go ahead and open up a new page here in Safari. And uh, what we're going to want to do is select the invisible text that's within the brackets there. So select this empty text now. So just click on it and then click and hold select all, copy, and now we can exit out of Safari, go to our folder, let's go ahead and put it into edit mode, and then we can select on the name, delete it, and then go ahead and paste in that blank text, and click done, and as you guys can see, the folder now has a blank uh, title. There's no title there whatsoever. Again, I think it makes it look really clean, and it's just a, a cool look, especially for the setup that I have going here on my 10s Max. Uh, again, like I said, all of the links you will need are down in the description. If you guys want my wallpapers, you can find them on my Telegram. The link for that is in the description as well. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, definitely throw me a thumbs up. It helps me out a lot here at the channel. And if you guys want to see more videos like this in the future, don't forget to click that subscribe button. This has been Jeremy, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Later.